They're large, covered by a shell, and have been known to feast on stucco. What are they? Well, giant snails. And as Maggie Newland reports, the creatures are a pest for South Florida homeowners. Snails are known for being slow, but agriculture experts are working fast to stop these snails from spreading across South Florida. We believe we have caught this just in the nick of time. An invasion of slimy, striped-shelled pests that, at least by snail standards, live up to their name, giant African land snails. I think they are beautiful, but they're, they populate at an, an incredible rate. I mean, exponential is an understatement. Jason Kesser saw one for the first time in his mother's house in Miami. I thought it was like a dream or something. <laughs> it was like a mythic creature that walked across. It was about that big. At the time, he didn't realize the snails were dangerous. But as soon as the Florida Department of Agriculture learned there were giant African snails in Miami, it joined with the USDA to launch an emergency response, searching houses around Southwest 33rd Court for the snails. They've already found about a thousand. These we just found shaking out some foliage and, and looking in the leaf litter. The snails quickly destroy vegetation. They'll eat stucco off a house. And just one snail can lay 1,200 eggs a year. It can actually be so numerous it becomes traffic hazards. Um, I've heard of the shells puncturing tires. And the snails can carry a parasite that causes meningitis, which is why Jason Kesser is thankful he didn't decide to get rid of the snails himself. I mean, we got to the point where we were just going to, you know, maybe boil them up and, and eat them. I, we're just not that French, so we didn't, we didn't go for that. But thank God we didn't, because I think that, that probably would have been unhealthy.